Okay. Oh, what? Do late game quest and that everyone's. Um, yeah, this is cross code. Don't know a whole lot about the game. All I know is it's supposed to be good, and I, I didn't know what else to play. I was throwing a couple of things around, and I just ended up with this one. It's designed with challenge in mind for both combat and puzzles. We encourage every player to try the game when it's intended difficulty. However, if those challenges end up making the game less enjoyable or even inaccessible for you, you have options to tweak difficulties through assist tab in the options menu. Bento chan. Oh, I'm not moving. I know you can hear me. Where is he? Uh, Shizuka, I have asked you to leave. So you're keeping him here? What do you think you are doing? Time is running short. We don't have a choice. So you abduct a dying person and let him work until his last breath? Is that it? I'm going to talk some sense into him. Don't get in my way. Was uh Shizuka, please don't do this. Sorry, but I can't let you go any further. Really? Gotcha. You'll have to do better than that. I like the twirl. You know what? Uh, this is what he wants as well. Sure, you'd think like... Uh, you'd like to think that you won't listen. Cold based? How creative. Oh, interesting. So there's elemental based attacks. Weak to heat? How surprising. Almost there. You interrupt him, all of his hard work will be lost. Don't do this. So, it never should have happened in the first place. Okay, this is it. You don't know when to stop, do you? Just watch. Okay. You can throw as many enemies as you like. The level threshold doesn't exactly work in your favor. I mean, I just want to go up here. Uh, Satoshi. Sister. What do you think you're doing? You're in no condition to do this kind of work now. All you should do is rest. Why should I rest when I'm way beyond recovery? I need to finish this work. It's my final task. I told you about the agreement. I finish this and they will let you go. No, I don't want this. Satoshi, stop it. It is done. No! Azuka, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry I got you involved in this. Just promise me that you will get away. Please. There you are, initialization successful. Oh, is the speech rate synchronization malfunctioning? Apparently. Well, something just had to go wrong. But you understand me, correct? God. Okay, we will make it work somehow. You are probably confused about the situation, correct? Alright, let's t just take small steps. Do you remember VRPs? Virtual ricochet projectiles? 
balls? Okay, you seem to remember. Clara, we are ready. Please initiate the training sequence. Uh, VRPs are the most essential tools and weapons. They're basically like balls. Test is it all these? Okay. I'll give it a shot, or rather, a throw. What the fuck? Nice work. Well, just to be sure, let's repeat this exercise with an extended distance. Something practical about VRPs is not being affected by gravity. No matter how far you are, is uh, no matter how far the VRPs will not. Drop. Very good. Okay, next, let us enable the charge mode. Okay. Activate charge VRPs by aiming for a longer time. Try practice this right away. Oh. Oh. Gotcha. Uh, they ricochet, that's... Yeah, okay, well that was quick. I suppose I talked too much again. Anyway, enough practice with VRPs. It is about time we put you down on your feet. So are we done here? You can terminate the flotation sequence. Hey there, girl. Welcome to our cozy cargo hold. My name's Clara. Nice to meet you. Sure are a quiet one. Apparently there's an issue with her speech synchronization. She still understands this, though. No way. Is there a way to fix it? I do not know yet. I will have to look into it. Uh, anyway, I'm sure we'll be able to understand each other somehow. Nonverbal communication, you know? Atta girl. Still, kind of would like to know your name. Uh, Sergey. Can you help us out here? Alright, her name is Leah. Leah, well, ain't that sweet. Well then, Leah, ready to get up? We gotta get you ready for what's coming. Ball throwing and the like, you know? And I got a, just the thing prepared for you. Follow me. Ball throwing. <laughs> Ooh, I can save the game at any time. Huge, huge, okay. What the fuck? Alright, let's get started. Your task is to reach the door at the other end of this room, and don't mind me, I'll just stick around and keep an eye on you. Well, I might give you some hints if you ask it nicely, you know. Uh, oh yeah, never mind, I just need to see what you're doing. Uh, we will explain it to you later, okay. switches away. Gotcha. It's a multi-hit switch. Uh, they're not, they're not balls. Oh, come on. Nobody calls them that anymore. Yes, unfortunately. How the hell? Oh, I can't. I got baited. <laughs> I got baited so hard. Well done. Yeah, that was all. It's a small room. 
Oh, finally, this one's my favorite. You can go wild with these robot mice. Moving target practice. Have fun, girl. Okay, does the charge shot do more damage? Okay. Yes, the charge shot does about 10 more damage. standing unpenetrated for centuries. Apparently somebody had fun. It's hard to read the test text and play the game, damn it. Whoa, slow down there, girl. Just a short warning. Here you'll meet your first real enemies. By real I mean these things will in fact attack you. Don't get me wrong, they're really easy, but still, if you do get beat down, your respawn point is right in this room. Uh, that means there's no real danger. Go ahead and kick some ass. Oh, in just a moment. Let me enable the dash module before we start the battle. Uh, dash is essential in battle since it helps you to quickly dodge any attacks at any time. Right, he is. Now please enter the room in order to proceed with the ass kicking. Good luck in there. A bit of advice. Hit them with charge balls to cancel their attacks. Oh, you can just dash while doing that. Okay. Yes, that was awesome, girl. Sergey, you weren't kidding. She really does have a knack for battling. That uh, sure takes me back. Hey, champ, get your adrenaline down again for a sec. You gotta add a bit more edge to your arsenal. A sharp one, that is. I see you, uh, that got your attention. Sergey, you finished? Yes, unlocking virtual proximity impact now. Melee act. Great, with those close combat strikes called VI, or VPI, uh, we can quickly tear through several targets in your path at once. Only them close ones, of course. You got that? Sharp as a blade. Now, start by clearing that path, will you? Oh, uh, wait there for a sec. Yeah, 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 I know. A second waited is an attack wasted. So you should know that your strikes have enough punch to interrupt someone's attacks. You can just pummel your opponent without giving them a chance to strike back. Sounds like a plan, am I right? So go get them. Close and fast. Oh, all right. Nice moves. They didn't even see it coming. Uh, not modeled after bossy. And another victory for a fearless gladiator leap. Oh, first time I got hit. Amazing work, number sure. Uh, and you just crossed the finish line. Congrats. Yes, girl, that was quick. Uh, looks like you've never forgotten the basics at all. Oh my, you still look so puzzled about all this. I suppose it's all about time we explain all the circumstances. You bet it is. Let's take a short break before that, okay? still need to report to the captain. He wants to meet Leah as well. Good idea. Let's not keep Jet waiting for too long. Come on, Leah. Right this way. Alright, up to the bridge. Oh yeah, Leah. Just a heads up. The captain's kind of grumpy. Don't worry about it. That's just the way he is. Uh, Cap, I'm back with the report. I see. Go on. The initiation, a total cinch. He's the avatar. Here's the avatar. Name's Leah. Right, hard to miss that last. Hope you didn't run to everything with those horns there. 
Wait, don't tell me you didn't notice the horns till now, Leo. Hey, make sure you clean up the mess you started down in the cargo hold soon. Yes, Cap. I hope Sergei is satisfied. You're around? Yeah, just give me a sec to set up your headset. Hello there, Jet. My good man, it's been a long time. Indeed, you still cling to that jetpack I see? You know I've never traveled to sea without good old Betty. Anyway, I hope you two will be ready to travel on soon. Having a darn avatar on board is just causing, calling for trouble, of course. We'll make this as brief as possible. Hey, Cap, what kind of welcome is that supposed to be? Besides, we... Uh, ain't we talking about Jet, former VRP dueling champ? Keep telling us about all of their combat moves from the old days. So here I thought maybe you wouldn't, you'd want to give Leah a small combat lesson. You're telling me that we less is up for a battle? Yeah. Oh, you bet she is. Right. See, we'll see about that. Let's talk to you later today. Sweet. Now then, dis you're dismissed. You can show the last around the ship, but don't stir up any trouble. All right, Captain. Come on, Lee, it's the first time some fresh air. Uh, welcome aboard MS Solar. Quite the ship, huh? You know, the view here is nice, but you gotta see what's below the bow. We're currently steering towards Rhombus Square. That's something to look at. Actually, why not go to the bow and explain the situation to there? Thinking, seeing Rhonda Square will make it easier for her to understand, correct? Hey, good thing, Sergey. Follow me. There she is, the Avatar. She's a Spheromancer class. How awesome is that? Looks like you got your first fan. Hey there, Clara. Good to see you. About all these strange boxes here. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to clean that up. But right now, I have to take care of the Avatar, you know? I'll do it in a bit. Okay, see you later. There she goes again. She said exactly the same thing yesterday. The Spheromancer are so awesome. Uh, well, is this way? It's a bit of a walk, though. Just follow me. Oh, uh, were all those indestructible boxes doing in that room anyway? I was just practicing to uh, how to use those things, you know? Probably should have done that else somewhere else. Yeah, oh. girl, have a look at this. Okay, where to start? How about, welcome to Cross Worlds. One step at a time, Clara. You remember the concept of an MMO. I know what an MMO is. Massively online multiplayer. All right. Yeah, Cross Worlds is like an MMO, just one striking difference. The world of this game is not virtual, it is real. All players are remotely connected to this world through special avatars. These avatars have a physical form and tightly connected to all five senses of the player. And you, Leah, are currently logged into the game as well. Oh, me? No, I'm not a player. I just work here. In fact, you're the only avatar in this whole ship. This is correct. This cargo ship belongs to the maintenance staff of Cross Worlds. The actual game takes place in the land be over there, the playground. The reason you are here, Lee, is because you are not a regular player. You have lost your memory, and we are trying to recover it. You see, you have been in this game before. Being logged in this game, there's a chance you might remember your past. And that is why we will try to get you into the real playground soon. Yeah, in fact, you'll be going to that glass palace of a city over there. The Rhombus, that's Rhombus Square. It's where all players start. Well, I guess this clears up some things at least, right? Alright then, I think this is a good time to split. I'm gonna go talk to the captain and try to set up that combat lesson for you. Meanwhile, you can have a look around the ship if you like. The crew knows about you. I guess you already noticed that, right? You can meet me and the captain later. Until then, just make sure not to fall into the water, girl. By the way, Leah, I had a closer look at the speech recognitions as you. Unfortunately, I do not believe... Or I do not think I'll be able to fix them soon. However, I found a little workaround. Uh, it might be hard to code specific audio patterns into your speech mod. Or hard code specific audio patterns. That means you will be able to say certain words. Could be a bit help, correct? But let's try it out. New word ebbed high. 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 High, 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 high. 
to work. Should help you start some conversation with the new crew. Hi. Hello there. You must be the quest. Uh, you must be a guest on the ship, right? Oh, don't be shy. We see men look rough, but we're really easy going. Uh, what do you want? You want to know what I'm doing here? Yes. Currently checking up the solar panels here. They're our primary energy source, so they better work properly. Otherwise, our nice, shiny MS solar won't budge a centimeter. Trust me, being stuck in the ocean too long is not something you want to experience. Hmm. I suppose you did not even notice you are an avatar. Well, the human appearance is pretty convincing. Except for the hair color. My man said the hair color. Okay. Okay, so you can dash quite a few times in a row, but not infinitely. Alright. Gonna go. Oh, wait. Oh, Miss Avatar is back. Hi. Oh, she talked to me. Hey, calm down there, fellow. Anyway, Clara has just passed us again. She told us that you could take care of all the boxes here. I mean, really, can you believe that woman? Now she's loading off her work on our guest. Well, she has a point. It's easy to destroy these boxes with your avatar weapon, right? Odds. Uh, awesome, please. I want to see that. Well, no pressure, you know. Just our guest, after all. But you'd help us out a lot. Will you destroy the boxes for us? Yes. Show us the balls. Cool, that was amazing. Well, it certainly works. Oh. Oh, those are only destructible from one side? Interesting. There we go. Fucking A. Oh, come on. Just a little bit over. Thank you. Oh, is that all of them? All clear. Truly amazing. I'm really surprised how quickly those balls were flying. What are you even talking about? I didn't see any balls. Only those boxes disappearing for whatever reason. Yeah, you need to wear these AR goggles to see them. The balls and their impact are like virtual and stuff. I see, so that's why you've been wearing those goofy glasses all day. Goofy, you know nothing about style, lady. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, thanks a lot for the help. Yes, thank you so much, Miss Avatar. Oh, uh, cargo hold? Interesting. Alright. Well, I don't think there's actually... Uh, well... No, okay. I don't think there's anything actually down here. I just wanted to check it out. Cabin. Oh, there they are. Kind of just... Normal video game character shit. I can't just rummage through all their shit. Um, okay. I'll do this thing and probably... Oh, you spoke. Is your voice finally back? Wait, that ain't right. Her speech recognition is still malfunctioning. It's hard-coded the word hi into her speech module. That's all she can say for now. I'm currently working on adding more words. I see. It's a start, I suppose. Anyway, the captain here have been planning out your combat training, girl. We're almost set. Good to go. Uh, alright, this is going to be interesting. Well, I'm off to my cabin for some final preparations. I'll be done in no time. Can you stick with the captain, okay? See you later. Uh, I'll be on the. I'll be back on the bridge. You can talk to me when you're ready for the lesson. Make sure you're prepared. I'd be expecting your full attention. Uh, ye two over there. Make sure you clean up the gallery after you've done cooking. Understand? Aye, aye, Captain. Not like we forgot since the last time you told us. Yeah, wasn't that yesterday? <laughs> All right. All right. Gonna do a quick save. Alright. Uh, there you are. It's about darn time for your combat lesson. You ready? Yes. 
good, let's go to the balcony. Uh, good, here we are. Carla, are you ready up there? Yes, Captain. Don't forget the goggles. Aye. Haven't worn these for some time. Alright then, time to start. I told you you learn the basic down to the cargo hold. Uh, still, first I want you to show me your grip on aiming and throwing. Carla, prepare the target bot. Say hello to the old friend. Listen carefully, I want you to hit that robot from the distance ten times. Do it quickly, got that? Nods. Yeah, I understand the basics well enough. That will make things easier, Clara. We need that turret now. Uh, time to turn on old Betty. Thanks for practicing the dash. The turret will now start shooting at you. I want you to do two things. Keep your keep your aim on the turret, but don't throw anything. And dodge the turret's bolt without losing your aim. Alright then, start. Ah. Uh, uh, you have to be fast in that last. Don't you think about simply walking past them shots. Dash at the right moment. God. Okay. I'm sorry. Oh, God, the tracking on that. He was not fucking kidding about the right time. Nice work. Enough with dodging. Now try to handle these attacks, lass. Oh, Jesus. What the heck was that? Oh, you can do a darn guard, lass? Well, actually, Jack, as a matter of fact, she does not. We're about to activate her guard module. Target, are you serious? You can't send that last into battle without a proper shield? Yes, I'll fix that right now. Good, you now have your shield. Need your instruction on how it works? Yes. Alright, listen closely. Basic first, just show me your shield. Uh, good. Note that the shield will only block the front. Oh, and finally you can aim during guard. It'll slow, but it'll work. Okay. Got the basics? Yes. Good, now it's about time to give this block a swarm, right? Here goes. Good, that's all the basics I can teach you for now. You round everything up. Let's proper battle against the turret. You can use everything you learn, though. There will be a little surprise waiting for you. I'll let you take a short breather. Talk to me when you're ready. Ready for battle? Yes. Do what I like to hear begin. Hello, Captain. I'm sorry to interrupt, but we need you on the bridge right now. What's the matter? Something's approaching us and quickly. Bloody darn timing. Sorry, right, last. We have to stop here. Duty calls. Carla, you clean up the balcony first and come to the bridge afterwards. Understood. Well, I have no idea what's going on here, but it's better for you to go inside, too. Okay, well, unfortunately, I have to stop right now. Because it's very late, but... We'll find out on next time. Bye!